Hello everyone. Did you safe in when your phone's stolen? Just active this simple setting to protect your iPhone. Let's talk how to protect your iPhone and data while someone's stolen your iPhone. Just think, this iPhone now on hand of thief, or someone find it when you left. First thing is thief do. Put your iPhone airplane mode and remove the SIM. Usually no need to unlock iPhone to put airplane mode. Just drag the control center and can active airplane mode. Then we lost a signal find our phone after your SIM card remove and throw away. So what about your iPhone data? That's why we need this simple setting active in iPhone prevent this. Follow me and save your iPhone from today. <laughs> Open setting and drag down the find the face ID and the password setting. Now we can see face ID and other normal setting. Their juts drag down and we can see stolen device protection. This is the extra security layer coming with iPhone. When your iPhone is away from familiar locations, with stolen device protection, some features and actions have additional security requirements. When your iPhone is away from familiar locations, such as your home or workplace, these requirements will help prevent someone who has stolen your device and knows your passcode from making critical changes to your account or device. You may also be required to wait an hour before using your iPhone to make changes to critical security settings or your Apple account. If your iPhone is not in a familiar location, you must authenticate using Face ID or Touch ID. Wait for the security delay to end, then authenticate with Face ID or Touch ID again to update settings such as the following. Drag down more in Face ID and Password setting and disable the control center. This feature prevent the put airplane mode when lock screen. It's mean when disable this feature, unable to drag down control center to put airplane mode anymore. We can active erase date when someone try passcode more than 10 times, but make sure to enable this after enable backup your iPhone date. We can manage the iPhone backup setting in the Apple account section. Click iCloud and find the iCloud backup. Usually free plan, we get five gigabytes iCloud space. If your iPhone have more than five gigabytes, private things, you should buy storage first. Find my phone. This is famous trick, but now we can see advanced options here. After enable this feature, you can add your family member or friends to see your location. When your phone's stolen, you can track phone location easily. In new phone, we should enable find my phone option first and make sure to active face ID and password to iPhone. Then switch to home screen and get find my phone by searching menu. Now we can see new setting and map location in our phone. Then click plus icon and select share my location. Now you can share your phone location with family member or with your trust friend. When a thief steals a phone, one of the first things they often do is remove the SIM card. This allows them to use the device with a different network or to prevent the victim from using their phone number to track the device. To counter this, the use of eSIMs has become an effective solution. Unlike traditional physical SIM cards, eSIMs are built directly into the device and are not removable, providing an added layer of security. We can add or convert our SIM to eSIM in iPhone cellular setting. So this is the my video about best setting for keep your iPhone safe from thief. Comment me below, do you know more about iPhone setting? Thank you for watching me and hope you subscribe me to watch more videos. See you again in next video.